Hi, welcome to our Pharma Topics channel. Our topic of discussion is appetite stimulants, appetite suppressants, digestives and carminatives. Let us see about appetite stimulants. They are also called orexians. Loss of appetite is a common complaint and is termed anorexia. Contributing reasons include depression, acute and chronic infections, HIV, advanced stages of cancer, pregnancy and hypothyroidism. Alcohol, the, the appetite stimulants are, uh, one is alcohol, 10% uh, alcohol acts as appetite stimulant, but, uh, but its use is restricted because of its abuse potential. It is a constituent of many appetite stimulants and tonics. Megastrol, it's a progesterone derivative used as an appetite stimulant in uh, cancer and HIV cases. And dexamethasone is an effective appetite stimulant, which acts uh, as a stimulant in terminally ill patients. Cyproheptadine is a H1 antihistaminic drug having appetite stimulant property. Because of the sedation, it is not used nowadays. The next is appetite suppressants. They are also called anorexians. These drugs are supplements which reduce appetite and is used in treatment of obesity. The centrally acting anorexians are amphetamine, which is a sympathomimetic drug. Its adverse effects are hypertension, tachycardia, and rapid development of uh, tolerance. Fenfluramine, it is a 5-HT agonist. Its adverse effects are drowsiness, diarrhea, and dry mouth. It is also not safe for patients with cardiac diseases. Sibutramine, it inhibits the reuptake of serotonin, norepinephrine, and dopamine. The adverse effects are headache, insomnia, dry mouth, constipation, hypertension, and tachycardia. The new drug is Rimonobant. It is a cannabinoid receptor CB1 antagonist. It inhibits lipogenesis and increases production of adiponectin, decreases LDL cholesterol levels. It is also useful in smoking cessation, treating drug addiction with opiates. The adverse effects are dizziness, nausea and upper respiratory tract infections. The peripherally acting anorexians are Bulk anorexians uh, such as uh, methyl cellulose, they increase the bulk in the diet and also increase the feeling of satiety. Non-absorbable uh, fat uh, substitutes uh, such as olestra, it is a mixture of sucrose and fatty ester which is neither digested nor absorbed. Orally stat, it suppresses uh, pancreatic and other lipases and prevents the degradation of the dietary fat. It also decreases total cholesterol and LDL cholesterol levels. Let us see about uh, digestants. Digestants promote the digestion of food yeah, used when the enzymes of the GAT are deficient. The retin use in tonics and appetite stimulants, improving mixtures, is irrational. One is uh, pepsin. It is prepared from the gastric mucosa of uh, pigs, cattle, or sheep. It is useful in achalia, a condition with the gastric acid secretion, as well as pepsin, pepsin secretion are compromised. Uh, and also seen in uh, stomach cancer and pernicious anemia. And next is uh, pepain. It is a proteolytic enzyme obtained from uh, raw papaya. And pancreatin obtained from pig pancreas contains amylase, trypsin and uh, lipase. It is indicated for uh, chronic pancreatitis or other exocrine pancreatic deficiency states. New enzymes are diastase and tachydiastase. These are the enzymes obtained from the fungus Aspergillus uh, oryzae, useful in uh, patients with pancreatic deficiency and next is uh, carminatives they are household uh, remedies which are used in our uh, routine culture so carminatives are substances used to relieve gaseous uh, distension in stomach improve the digestion uh, and the, in the intestine after meals asafoetida camphor clove coriander cinnamon ginger fennel anise and cardamom seeds they irritate the gastric mucosa and cause expulsion of gas. So uh, the widely used ones are camphor, anise oil, cardamom oil and other uh, carminatives. Uh, I hope uh, it's a short nutshell information of uh, the anorexians, appetite stimulants, uh, digestants and carminatives. I hope uh, this video will be useful for you. Thank you for listening. Happy learning. Kindly share this to more of your friends. Kindly subscribe to our Pharma Topics channel for further updates. If you like this video, kindly press the like button. Thank you.